Wood Nation, what's going on, bros and bros? Man, look, this is Wood Jr. I trust all as well. Y'all, this is the day, man. About to go pick her up. About to go pick up Eagle. Just like my guy, man, TD205. Man, he just got his bike back, too, man. All right, babe. Love you. Y'all already know who this is right here. My guy, Ross the Cross. What's up, my guy, Ross? Oh, Come say what's up to Wood Nation, man. What's going on, Wood Nation? There it is. It's my guy, Ross the Cross, right there, y'all. Ross, everybody be like, where Ross? Ross, tell him, say, VIP. You know, hey, we, we have a thing in, in our community it's called Nunya. Tell him, Ross, say, Nunya business. Nah. <laughs> What's going on with you, bro? All right, man. Ah. Good nation, bros, bro. So me and my guy Ross talking, man. And he said something about, uh, was it Rose World or World 66? Route, uh, Route 66, riding coast to coast, basically. It goes from Chicago to uh, LA. But uh, on, the, on the BCH, you can get one of the get one of the redwood trees that you can drive through. And it's 40 foot? It's like 40 foot around the tree. Man, how cool is that? Man, look, put it in y'all. Look, put it in the comments if y'all heard about that, man. And Rose, this is on our bucket list, right? It's on the bucket list. Man, look, so, hey, y'all already know I'm gonna be riding that ride with Ross, man. We're gonna do 60, Route 66, where is it? From the where's the start? Chicago to LA. There it is. Right there. Wait, that's that's from Chicago. Yeah. Oh wow, man, that's some rock, Ross. You may have to do that one on your own. No. <laughs> man, that's some riding, man. Woo. So yeah, we just talking about riding, man, because uh, you know, me and wifey, I uh, was planning our trip, man. And listen, y'all, I can't say where we going, although most of y'all already know. But come on, y'all already know. We like to do a little something special and something extra. But I do want to ask this question. Oh, Ross, let me ask you first. Do you have your passport? Do you have a passport? Oh yeah. Is it current? Current. What? How old were you when you got your first one? I was young. Really? Yeah. Man, Ross, I just got mine today. Oh man. Yes, bro. <laughs> Guys, Ross. Let me out. I'm a wild dude. Yeah, the country called the Oh well, yeah, that's right because of your job. That's right. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Well, um, so now you know what I'm saying. There's um. You know some opportunities that presented itself so i was like hmm. so yeah man i literally just got my passport today or i went to the uh, post office today and man two huge thumbs up man to everyday fate listen guys do not text everyday fate in the morning she's not a morning person <laughs> and if you do at least say good morning <laughs> so yeah man i have my passport or uh it's going to be expedited to me i got it expedited so Sorted the process on that, man, to God be the glory. Bro, I didn't know you got yours when you were young. Like in your 20s or like 30s? Uh, I was a teenager. A te wow, Ross was a teenager. All right, Ross, you just showing off now. <laughs> hey, Wood Nation, put in the comments, man, how old were you when you first got your passport? I ain't ashamed to admit it, man. I'm 45 and I just now started the process of getting my passport. They say it'll be in like six to eight weeks, six to eight weeks, but if you expedite it, it can come in a lot sooner. So I decided to go ahead and expedite it. So, man, put in the comments, how old were you when you got your first passport? These young folks are getting it like, man, they're like in their 20s. I was in the post office. Ross, this little kid, man, this dude was like, couldn't be no more than 20 years old. Come on. I get it, my passport. I was like, scram. <laughs> Ross, would you do a trike? Honestly. Uh, when, I, when I have to ride a track, I'm putting the bike down because it's no longer a motorcycle. <laughs> you put it on kickstand. I'm just telling you. See, Ross don't do trikes, I man. Out, I went out to California on mine. Uh huh. Right? I pretty near fell asleep. Really? I sat in the crew. I ain't got nothing to worry about. I'm sitting back there just ride comfortable. Wow. On a trike? On a trike. Yes. Sir. I mean, to each his own, you know? I know. But wow. I'm saying, I ain't got to worry about nair nothing. You gonna get one? I ain't getting one. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, dude, Bruce, sir? Hey. How you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. oh, speaking of trikes, okay. Oh. Wow. This got all the bells and whistles look like. Ross, now, okay, I, I gotta be honest, this baby look good. Look at the lights, man. Now that is cool. Wow. Wow. 
What's up, my guy? <laughs> Check it out, Wood Nation bros and bros. This is what me and Ross Cross was talking about. Well, actually, Ross. So look, if you guys rode your bikes through this, man, the Redwood Forest, bro, put it in the comments below. This is definitely on our bucket list. This is cool right here, man. Nation bros and bros, I'm about to hop on equal, check it out, make sure everything's good. But before I do, what are you gonna say to a big guy? Keep it shiny side up and the rubber side down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Appreciate wow, you, bro. Man. Ah all right, Wood Nation bros and bros, I'm about to check equal out. Just the router, make sure I notice the difference, you know what I'm saying, in the brakes, all this good stuff that I had done. You know what I'm saying? I want to make sure I notice the difference, make sure there's no lights, make sure everything is good. And bros and bros, check it out. Man, two thumbs up to my guy Mike and his wife, man. Check it out, man. Y'all see the shirt? Man, look, mental health, man. Mental health awareness is a big deal, man. Make sure, bros and bros, you keep your mental health healthy. Keep it healthy, bros and bros. Keep it healthy. Keep it healthy. Go get with them.
Cubs and Bruins. But when I hit my rear brake, it's almost like I got to smash on them like an emergency type of smash just to get some type of reaction out of it. And with my front brake, when I'm going like um, uh, anything like 50 and over, when I hit my front brake, there's a deep vibration. And of course, I know I'm not slamming on it, but when I hit it to slow down or shift lanes or, you know, downshift, there's a vibration and it should be shaking like that. So let me see what's going on, man. Let me see if they'll look at it. See this break here? When you barely do that, you know, you're supposed to feel it. I had to go all the way down just to get it to actually, you know, just to get a reaction out of it to actually stop. So I don't know. Uh, hopefully it's just a minor thing because, you know, we're getting close to our trip, you know, but hey, even if I have to delay the trip, man, safety is first. This is why I'm glad I come do my test rides to check it out. You know what I'm saying? To let them know. And they're good about checking things out in a timely manner. So we'll see what happens, man. All right, Wood Nation bros and bros. So equals back in the shop, man. Listen, if you guys have any issues with your bike, don't be afraid to turn around and give it back to them. So they're going to check out the front and rear brakes. Like I said, with the rear brakes, I had to really put pressure on it just to stop at a red light when I got off the highway. And the front brakes would just vibrate a lot. So, like I said, man, if you guys know what the issue is, please let me know. I'm ready to ride, but I'm also ready to ride safe. So I called a taxi. Uh, they didn't pick up, so I called an Uber. Excuse me. Are you are you with Uber? Uh, yes, I'm here to pick up uh, uh, Stephen Wood. Stephen Wood. I, I don't know who. Well, okay, so I have a YouTube channel, okay? It, it's me. Uh, but I, I, I'm just trying to get a ride home. Are you headed my way? Yes, I am. You headed my way? Yeah, come on in. You sure? Yeah. You look great, by the way. I'm married, but I must say, you are a dog. Can I get a quick peck? Just a quick Absolutely. peck? Absolutely. Okay, wait. Okay. Oh, Making sure the boss ain't around. Look, the boss not here. The wife's not here. Oh, my gosh. Here we go. Oh, oh my gosh. I just cheated. <laughs> just kidding, guys. That is my wife. Do not cheat. Blessings. I will see y'all at church tomorrow.